My name's David Isaac. I'm registered blind. I live on the estate with my family, a wife and two daughters. We've been here for eight months now. Prior to this, we were in an emergency accommodation just around the corner. That was very hard for us. We were split up as a family. Um, being given this place means for the first time in, in three years, we're, we're all together. Both my children are in sixth form. They're, they're, they're only just being settled. From, um, from being a, a disjointed family and not being in a, a settled residence and not being a, a family as a whole, uh, they, they used to have to go and, and sit in the library before, for, just for a table to, to, to rest on. We never even had a table to, um, for them to study at. My wife works at a local charity. She's a, a project manager for a, a project that offers befriending services and, and have volunteers that will visit the, the, the elderly. So, so bad enough she has to look after me. She actually looks after a lot of other people in the borough. <laughs> and, um, and, and she loves the work that she does. The upcoming redevelopment is very scary for us uh, we've finally settled in a place where it's both safe and functional for me prior to losing my sight uh, I was like a lot of people it wouldn't have entered my consideration that, that the needs of, of, of somebody in, in my position now where I, I learn routes by landmarks by lampposts and, and, and gutters and things like that uh, I, I come into the state, I follow the curb, I hit a lamppost, uh, I make a right turn, I follow the yellow lines until I hit the second gutter and then that's my house. The high probability is that they will move us out of London. Now, bearing in mind, it, it took me almost a year to learn the way around here. And that was when my wife wasn't working full time and she could spend more time taking me around. Uh, and if it took me a year to learn uh, this area, a, a new location where I'm having to learn the, learn the route just at the weekends, I don't even want to think about. <laughs> the actuality of it is, if I get moved somewhere out of this area, I'm uh, essentially being sentenced to being housebound. And you get the impression that they these people that have these expensive flats, you're paying 1.2 million, 1.5 million pounds for a flat. You don't want to be looking out of your window and looking at a council estate. So get rid of these people. And 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 that really is the way that it feels. Being blind, walking onto the estate, I've had quite a few people come up to me and offer help. And um and generally speaking, uh, after a short chat, you get to know people as well. And, and, and I stand out in a crowd, so people, <laughs> people do recognise me and know me. It's wonderful. What I have here is, uh, is a good life. It really is. And, um, and, and, and I wouldn't want to lose it.